Hello, Crazy Surfer here. Another Indie Atlantic Sunrise video. So first I took a sunrise and I broke it up into different clips and then sparsed in different shots from the beach. My favorite seashell. Next, just like people, the animals on the beach got to find them some breakfast with the reflection. I thought it was a good shot. Yum yum sushi. Just like the people who get up and work out are in the Atlantic residents do too. What beach walk wouldn't be complete without watching Charlie and Harry chase that ball. Perfect slow-mo, great reflection, another killer beach shot. And of course after a workout it's time for a shower. Just like in the real world, on the beach, everybody gets cleaned up before heading off to work. After one of the storms of this summer, the sand was refilling in the beach and we had one of those big tidal pools. And with the sunrise, I caught this river flowing back from the little tidal pool, slowed down this wave breaking, and wow, did it turn out good. Slow motion waves are awesome. And so this fall, of course, I was fortunate enough to see some baby turtles in the daylight. I hadn't seen too many up until this point. I had my camera. It is always a good time when you get to film a turtle going back out to sea. I am pretty sure along this stretch of beach of Indian Atlantic, in whatever form these turtles communicate, they go, hey, did you happen to catch that nut on the beach with the camera that keeps bothering us? And they go, oh yeah, we know that guy. He's been here for years, man, years. And alas, our young champion heads out to sea. So the next group of species that I annoy are the pelicans with my drone. They also communicate, and sometimes you can't even see any come down the beach in the Atlantic because they know I'm around. But when they do and the water's calm, I get above them and I close in and the reflection is just gorgeous. I really do love following the pelicans with the drone. I'm sure it makes them nervous, but hey, everybody's got to have a problem in their life. Next, I use another quick shot of a baby turtle at night. I believe the full moon was in the background, and with the night light on my video camera, the shadow makes it look so cool. Again, I know, I shouldn't be bothering the baby turtles, but man, look at that shot. It's so adorable. Last but not least are two of my favorite surfing waves of all time. The first one is on my one of my favorite boards, the 11-foot monster Moby Dick. This board is made by Hobie. It was built for me. I love this board. It is hard and heavy, but once you get locked in, you get waves like this and the classic crazy surfer exit. Jumping out the back, having that board just drag you. And this is my favorite wave from Hurricane Bertha. Getting up early, was supposed to be cleaning pools, parked the truck, went out and caught a few, and caught this gem. Your, your joy at the end when I just come off the wave, come tumbling down, hit the back of that board. I was bruised for four or five days, and I didn't even mind. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.